let's now talk about Bangladesh, where political violence has gripped the nation for over a week now. In a key decision passed by the Labour Ministry, Bangladesh has raised the minimum labour wage for garment workers by 56.25%. Now, this is the first such hike since 2019. And the move begs the question, will the issue of minimum wage become a game changer in Bangladesh's upcoming elections? Well, after obtaining approval from Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina, the State Minister for Labour and Employment announced that the new minimum wage for ready-made garment workers will now be 12,500 Bangladeshi taka, which is roughly around 113 US dollars. Well, the decision was, has rather come after days of political violence that gripped the nation. However, the Garment Factory Worker Union has rejected this proposal and demanded that the minimum wage figure be tripled. From a political standpoint, the timing of this decision is fairly crucial. The workers' union is butting heads with the Hasina-led government over wages, and that to at a time when the opposition parties are mounting pressure on Sheikh Hasina to step down. The Bangladesh Prime Minister has drawn criticism over accusations of running an authoritarian regime, with elections in the country stated to be held in January next year. It remains to be seen if Hasina will step down to the union's demands, or rather will agree to the union's demands on minimum wages, or will the opposition parties mount more pressure on the Bangladeshi government amid calls for boycotting the elections.